welcome back to my channel. My name is Georgina. I'm the Honest Vocal Coach. I do singing all day every day when I'm not making videos like this one. And today, it's Tribute Tuesday. It's a while since I've done a Tribute Tuesday, but I do like to do them on a regular basis. We look at some of the most influential and awesome singers of all time. Take a look at the playlist. There's quite a few already in there. People like Dusty Springfield, you know, some of the greatest vocalists that have ever been. Ah, so today we're going to be looking at Dion Warwick. Now, some may pronounce it as Dion Warwick or Warwick or Warwick. It's entirely up to you. I think it depends on where you come from. Now, for me, this song that I'm going to be reacting to is one of those that is just iconic and oh, it's just her song. And there's so many songs that she's sung, especially by Burt Bacharach, that are just... Ah, the emotional quality is just wonderful. And if you've never heard of this lovely lady, you should definitely find out more. Right, let's dive in. Dion ranks among the 40 biggest US hit makers between 1955 and 1999. Based on a chart history of the Billboard's Hot 100 Pop Singles chart, she is the second most charted female vocalist during the rock era of 55 to 99. She is also one of the most charted vocalists of all time, with 56 of her singles making the Hot 100 between 62 and 98 and 80 singles in total, either solo or collaboratively. During her career, she has sold more than 100 million records worldwide and has six Grammy Awards. She's also been inducted into the Hollywood Walk of Fame, the Grammy Hall of Fame, the R&B Music Hall of Fame, and the Apollo Theatre Walk of Fame. That's quite a lot. You looked inside my fantasies and made each one come true something no one else had ever found a way to do okay something that she has is this just a wonderful way of communicating the songs her emotion is superb but in this beginning it's very much narrative it's kind of a conversational way that she's singing it so it's not really soaring harmonies or soaring sustained notes or anything like that it's just simplistic telling the story i've kept the memories one by one since you took me in now you notice there that she's pushing the jaw forward, that's just natural for her to do that. It doesn't really make much difference to the voice, it's just kind of what she does. You'll also notice this as a little jaw shake when she does the agility notes. Her agility is super smooth, but she just does. It's this natural little movement when she sings those agility moments. And I know I'll never love this way again. vibrato is super rich and warm it's not fast it's not slow it's just sort of a medium speed she has this lovely way of clipping the notes as well it's sustained but then she clips it off so that the timing is perfection I know Just a little flat on the last note there, but you know, it's a live performance and she is just stunning. Well, I'll fool with blues tomorrow, reaching back for yesterday. I won't turn my head in sorrow if you should go away. No, I'll stand here and remember just how good it's been. It's so conversational. It just feels like she's singing right to you. 
great because she joined all of that and no I'll never all in one brilliant also I know I'll never it's not no there's no W whatsoever I know I'll never. So very much downplaced uh, in the sort of lower portion of her jaw here so that she's getting a richness to it. She's also relaxing the tongue so there's no tension in it. I'll never love this way again Hold on Hold on Hold on I so didn't see that coming. That little extra height of riff there. I've never heard that version before. Oh, Cold Shivers. Wow, wow. Such a beautiful song. Makes me want to cover this one. I'm not sure all of my younger audience would know it, but it's such a wonderful tune. Well, yeah. so I keep on. Before the good is gone. There's a Whitney element there and I know that Whitney was inspired very much by Dion and other sort of vocalists of that era that era. Uh yeah, it's just so good. Love this way again. some similarities so I keep on on the oh that agility I know that's great She so deserved that standing ovation. That end sequence, my goodness. The control was so impressive. Just a touch of twang in there to make sure she was able to belt it out, supported. That was gorgeous. I love that song. It takes me back. It really does. My folks were Motown fans, so I really know quite a lot of the Motown songs. That was fabulous. I really enjoyed that. So guys, if you don't know much about her, feel free to take a look at other performances. She is a queen. She is phenomenal. That is the wonderful Dion. So if you've got any performances of hers that you think are superb, let me know in the comments. And if there's some singers you think I should make sure are in my tribute Tuesdays. Let's add them in. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.